Brothers and sisters, this is Danny from CatchForChrist.net, and today we're going to be memorizing 2 Thessalonians 2.14. As always, we'll be using the Scripture Typer Bible Memory System app. This is the home screen, um, and you can always see the, the first video on this playlist for a more in-depth tutorial. But this is the home screen. Uh, you'll hit My Verses. You'll hit the plus sign at the bottom right-hand corner. Hit New Verse. Uh, choose your book. Today we are in actually a letter, Second Thessalonians, chapter two, verse fourteen. You'll enter the chapter and verse or verses notation. You can choose different English translations. You can also choose to categorize your verses into different verse collections. Then you'll hit import verse text, and then it should appear below. Hit save. And then just scroll down to wherever that verse is located. And once you select it, you'll start a three-step process. The first step is typing it. So typing it just entails hitting the first letter of each word, and the word should change from gray to black. He called you to this through our gospel, that you might share in the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. Second Thessalonians 2.14 and I like to recite as I'm going, he called you to this through our gospel that you might share in the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. Second Thessalonians 2.14 Once again, he called you to this through our gospel that you might share in the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. Second Thessalonians 2.14 I like to do each step at least three times. The next step is memorize it. Now the app is going to take away half the words. He called you to this through our gospel that you might share in the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. Second Thessalonians 2.14 Once again, he called you to this through our gospel that you might share in the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. Second Thessalonians 2.14 And one more time, you can notice how um, the app switches which half the words are visible each time he called you to this through our gospel that you might share in the glory of our lord jesus christ second thessalonians 2 14 and then the last step of course is just to type it without any on-screen helps he called you to this through our gospel that you might share in the glory of our lord jesus christ second thessalonians 2 14 and there you have it. Now, once you hit 100% accuracy, it might take a while. It usually takes me a little bit longer with, you know, longer passages. But once you get to 100% accuracy and you haven't made any mistakes, then try to get it at least two more times. So I always recommend to try to get it at least three times at 100% accuracy. That'll really um, help you ingrain the verse in your head, uh, the correct version of the verse in your head the first time around. So the next time... Um, when you review the verse or to recall the verse, it'll be a lot easier, um, at least in my point of view, from my experience. Um, also, it's important to read verses in context. So I'm going to post um, uh, this video in a post in the near future on the site, catchforchrist.net. Um, always good to read above and below to see what the verse is actually referring to. And, oh yes, the reason I like to recite the verse is because um, you're reciting, you're also listening to yourself recite, you're typing, and you're also reading yourself type um, the verse. So it's you're interacting with the verse in many different ways, and I think that's a great method for um, memorization. Uh, but thank you for watching this tutorial on 2 Thessalonians 2.14. This is Danny from Catch for Christ. There we go. Catchforchrist.net. Have a great day. God bless.